Hi guys, welcome to another video on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use HitPost Screen Recorder, one of the easiest screen recorder for Windows user. With HitPost Screen Recorder, you can record your computer screen with your webcam and record your mouse cursor and your audio from your microphone and system cell and you can also adjust the, the position and the size of your webcam. So I think it is very interesting and it's, it's, it is also very affordable too. And being mentioned that you can download and install this software for free. By the way, the output will be watermarked if you use a free version. Uh, to remove that watermark, you need to purchase a plan uh, from HitPaw. And I have a 30% discount coupon code in the description for you uh, if you want to save your money. Okay? Alright, so here you are at the main website of HitPaw. Uh, in order to download the screen recorder, you need to click here at the screen recorder tabs at the main website. Then uh, you will see here uh, there's a button here try it free or you can click the buy now button. So this version is available on Windows 10, 8 and 7 64 bit and they are building the Mac OS uh, version by the way uh, it is in the future so we don't care about that. Uh, if you want to buy the software you can click this buy now button I'm going to click on that and to see the different uh, pricing plans uh, so they have one one month plans at, at around 10 US dollar and one year's plan uh, 29.99 US dollar and lifetime plans I think this is the most affordable one uh, which is 49.99 US dollar if you want to purchase the software don't forget to use my 30 30% discount coupon code which I put in the description to save your money alright so let's go back to the download page here we can uh, you can click this button try it free and now yeah, it will download to your computer uh, and this is uh, the download uh, download files you can now uh, when it's finished you can just uh, double click on this file to install it on your computer supposing that you have finished the installation because I think it is very easy I don't want to to guide you step by step uh, on how to install the software this is a shortcut of the hit hit pause screen recorder you can double click here to open the menu okay so this is a, the toolbar menu so normally it will look like this but before doing that I want to hide my desktop uh, first and we have some option here and actually this toolbar is, is very simple the first one is a recording screen option and the second one is recording webcams. You can choose this option if you want to record only your webcam and it is a picture in picture we mean, uh, meaning that you can record your screen and webcam at the same time. Okay and there's some button here so if you want to capture your mouse you can click this button or you can, uh, can capture the keystroke you can also uh, click this button to enable and disable this option on top right of the toolbar you have some other options uh, for example you can click here to register the software and also uh, access to different user guide and feedbacks and logs and check for updates and also about page also and uh, one of the key things here before you start your screen recording you need to go to the setting because the setting is very important uh, before you start any uh, any recording okay so you can click this button to access to the setting here you have some some tab on the on the left side of the windows uh, firstly about the file so here's uh, all the file that i recorded on my computer and here's a video and image uh, by the way you don't need to care about the video and image file you click on all again and here at the output location make sure that you select a folder on your computer that has has enough enough empty space I'm sorry enough empty space uh, you can click here to open the folder or you can click here to select a, another folder on your computer for example I can click here and then uh, I create a folder called hit post uh, hit post video and then we can select the folder so uh, where, whenever you finish your screen recording your video will be here inside this folder okay you click here at this uh, button select folder to um, to make it your default location and uh, up next is the general tabs so here we have the option to uh, to enable or disable hardware acceleration by checking this uh, this hardware acceleration you can uh, record your screen smoothly especially for those of you who want to play games and uh, and recording uh, gameplays or stuff like that 
at the frame rate option you can select uh, 30, 30 frames per second for a normal tutorial like this or you can select uh, up to 60 frames per second for gameplays uh, so if you are gamers or stuff like that you can use this software to record uh, your gameplay and it will play smoothly okay and down here we have the resolution uh, resolution uh, for the for your recording or for your video you can see like 1080p or 4k up to 4k or, or 720p or stuff like that uh, it's all here at a setting okay so that is about the general tab and uh, let's go to the effect tab all right so at the effect tab we have two things Firstly, about the, uh, the mouse cursor, you can enable or disable your mouse cursor. Whenever I make a software tutorial, I always enable my mouse cursor because it is easier for my audience to, to watch the video and to follow the movement of my mouse instead of watching just a small white dot on the screen. So it is very important. And this software allows you to uh, select different color here. For example, I can select red or yellow uh, yellow is my favorite but by the way you can select any and down here we have the keystroke option yeah you have different preset for your keystroke this is a, uh, the first one the second one and third one and normally i will use this one and you can also enable it or disable it by this button we can show the keystroke or disable it by clicking this button okay for the touch uh, we have the screen recording schedule uh, if you want to uh, to enable the duration of your screen recording like 30 minutes or uh, any minutes you want for example we can say here 10 minutes or stuff like that you can enable this option otherwise you can just uh, disable it so you can start and stop your screen recording whenever you want okay so down here we have the device and device meaning that you have to select your webcams your microphone and your speaker uh, for example here if we select the webcam I can uh, turn on my Logitech webcam it is C210 uh, so it is not a good quality uh, webcam by the way I can turn it on now so you can see me on the screen okay uh, whenever I start my screen recording I can use this webcam and down here we have the microphone we have different options for the input microphone this is my mb1 pro it is um, my usb microphone that i use for uh, for recording voiceover okay and you can also select other other microphone here if you want uh, and here is the speaker it is it means that the audio from your computer okay so we can leave it by default and finally we have the hotkey option so uh, we can enable or disable the hotkey for example you want to start as, uh, the screen recording you can press f10 and you can pause the screen recording by f9 and you can hide or uh, show the menu by pressing f8 so that is uh, very easy at the setting right and we can close it now so remember when you have the setting uh, when you finish the setting it will be your default setting and whenever you want to start the screen recording it will be your webcam your um, uh, logitech the one that i selected and uh, uh, the audio from the uh, this microphone okay so let's start with the screen first you can click here at the screen recording and now you have the this uh, area you can uh, just simple uh, simply left click to record full screen or you can drag and drag an area on the screen uh, to record this is uh, an area selected area okay like this so we have this selected area and we can move it around the screen and uh, this is the screen recording so you can record a part of the screen and now you can uh, press this button to start recording or you can take a screenshot uh, it will take a screenshot of this area and the next option very interesting option in this software is about the PIP uh, we mean uh, the picture in picture uh, effect you can select here uh, if you want to record your screen and your webcam at the same time uh, so there are some preset here this is a screen and webcam so your screen uh, is at the bottom track and your webcam is uh, an overlays and this one uh, is vice versa so you have the webcam at the bottom track and your screen at the corner or stuff like that so you see here uh, so I'm go back to the screen and webcam okay so this option is a uh, recording webcam only and this one is a recording screen only on the right side you have the option to change the uh, the 
your webcam position or picture in picture position also there's some preset here is very handy there are nine different position for example you can put your webcam at the corner here top left corner or top right uh, or bottom right corner it is uh, okay so I'm going to leave it by this corner okay and for the picture in picture size you can change it to 25% or 50% or 70% for example if I click here to change it to 50% or you can uh, change it to 25% and also you can uh, adjust it uh, adjust it by uh, zoom in 5% 5% or stuff like that you can click just click uh, at this button to zoom in and click this button to zoom out so it's all up to you okay and if you want to see your webcam you can uh, click on this button uh, to go to the webcam setting here instead of going to the, uh, the setting menu so this is my webcam as you can see here uh, I am on the screen and uh, there's another option here to mirror the mirror your webcam to switch your webcam left and right you can click here to mirror your webcam and you can also click here to go back to normal and down here you can also select your webcam also and uh, now you can close this window and start a screen recording okay okay and now I'm going to start my screen recording and show you about the trim tools uh, in this software okay to do that we can click this button to start the screen recording all right so now it is recording my computer screen in this area uh, let's say something hello hello everyone welcome to my channel and this is Jackie Nguyen and this is a hitbox screen recorder one of the easiest screen recording software for Windows Mac OS and stuff like that so I'm going to click here and click there and click here there 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 there, there. okay and now we can stop the screen recording by pressing this button just uh, hit this button to stop Okay, so technically when you stop your screen recording, your, uh, your video or your screen recording is ready in the folder that you selected. And now you can close this toolbar. Uh, by the way, there's another option here. You can close the toolbars also. Uh, there's another option in this screen recorder. Uh, we use a trim, tool, trim tools. Uh, so you can split the video and trim the video and save it in many small parts here with this trim tool for example uh, this is the, the out point and this is the in point and you can uh, press this button to play the video for example if i want to just uh, keep this this part of the screen recording i can uh, start click this button to trim the video trim the video like this so this is a trim uh, video and i'm going to click save and that is uh, it will exporting the this part uh, to video and open in the output folder okay and save it in the the output folder and i'm going to click ok and what if i want to uh, to get another part on this on the video like this i can also do the same and i can also click trim again and i'm going to name it trim video number two okay and i'm going to click save Okay, so let's see this uh, the final video here at uh, this folder in the folder here This is a video number one uh, trim video. Let's double click to view it for in my computer screen in this area uh, Let's say something. Hello. Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. Okay, so you see that the video quality is very good all right, so that is about the recording screen option uh, in this uh, software. What if you just want to record your webcam only, okay? Uh, and you can click this button to record your webcam only. By the way, in this case, we can uh, disable the capture of the keystroke. So I'm going to disable it, and then I'm going to click the webcam recording. Now I need to select my webcam, okay? So this is the webcam that I'm going to select. And here we have the, some um, some more more setting for the webcam. Okay, so this is my uh, my webcam recording. You can also move around the screen, and you can also um, 
uh, select the resolution for your webcam for example if i want to select uh, 720p uh, only because my webcam is 720p only i can select it and also i can change the frame rate here uh, 30 frame is the maximum uh, frame rate uh, that my webcam can uh, capture and i can also enable and disable the mir mirror option here and now we can uh, click this button to start the, the webcam recording and let's say hello this is jackie and welcome to my channel who 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 yeah okay and now i'm going to stop the screen but before doing that we can take a screenshot for example here at the screenshot area okay so when you stop your new webcam recording you also have the trim tools here uh, i'm going to close this one and you can select different area on uh, your video to uh, for example you can select here this is a trim tool and you can click this trim tool to trim your video otherwise you just need to open the the output folder uh, open the output folder to view your screen recording or your webcam recording okay so this is my webcam recording and this is the the the, the image that i take uh, that i have just a uh, screenshot i'm going to double click at the image so it is a png image i think it's nice all right so this is my image and i can stop it now and this is my webcam recording so let's play it say hello this is jackie and welcome to my channel who 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 yeah very nice right uh, by the way the quality of the webcam is not very good because of my poor lighting condition by the way if you have a good lighting condition and and better webcam you can capture a very nice uh, video okay so let's close it all right so that is everything about hitbox screen recorder i hope you enjoyed the tutorial if you want to try this software don't forget to check out the link i put in the description and if you like the videos hit the like button and if you're new here consider to subscribe to my channel for more video like this thank you very much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye bye